Hello, we might be a small island, but snow in the British Isles can be highly variable from place to place, as we've seen this week. Some places buried under more than a foot of snow, others have barely seen a flake. And with cold air all the way from the north of Canada still over us as we end the working week, there's the potential for more wintry weather. Southern and eastern Britain on Friday seeing plenty of sunshine, but the northwest will continue to bear the brunt of rain, sleet and snow showers could cause disruption in some places, a yellow warning in force. But a particular focus is on southern Scotland, where through the rest of Friday, two to six centimetres of additional snow will build up at lower levels, more than 10 centimetres over the hills. Those kinds of amounts can cause significant disruption to transport, to power supplies and local communities, an amber warning in force for southern Scotland. Now, by Saturday morning, those snow showers will ease away, but our attention turns to the south, where a band of rain pushes in from the southwest, bringing with it much milder temperatures, 11 degrees in Plymouth. However, it runs into cold air, 10 degree temperature contrast between central England and the southwest. And as that runs into the cold air, there's the risk that it will turn to snow. Most of the snow will be over the Welsh mountains, the Cotswolds, and the Chilterns a centimetre or so in places. But at lower levels, uh, north of the M4, we could see some patchy covering of snow for a time on Saturday morning at low levels. But by the afternoon, that tends to fizzle out, disappears to the south, and our attention turns to this weather system moving in from the west by Sunday. Again, it pushes into much colder air across the country. Initially, it will be a spell of heavy rain and snow melt across Northern Ireland. Could cause problems here and there'll be heavy rain further south as well. But as that rain pushes into the colder air, it will turn to snow over the mountains of northern England and southern Scotland. Some significant snowfall building up during Sunday morning and early afternoon could cause disruption, a yellow warning in force. But it's also possible that some places at lower levels will see snowfall on Sunday. Highly variable amounts from place to place. Now, one thing that that will do as it clears through is it will bring milder air to the whole of the country by the end of the weekend, and that could cause problems in itself by melting much of the snow. So, a lot going on over the next few days, and you can find more details on the forecast and the warnings through the Met Office website, through our app, and via our social media channels.